Hello everyone, welcome back. So today I have this uh, funny idea that I came up with a friend. I have a mouse that uh, I will recommend to all those who are interested who are in playing Blitz or even Bullet Online. I will not uh, say all the technical details. I might do a separate video on it at some point if people would like. But if you are curious, this is how it's called. The G402 and Logitech and unfortunately I'm not getting <laughs> any commissions nor sponsorship for it I'm not putting any links or anything I just bought it uh, uh, by a recommendation from some strong players uh, that are known to be very good at bullet uh, one of whom is uh, Eric Hansen and uh, this mouse has a funky setting that uh, I discovered by accident that right here if you can see when when I hold it like this yeah sometimes my hand is pressing these two buttons right here and they they affect these two buttons they affect the speed of the mouse so if I press this the speed now is two now it's one you see if I press here it's two three four and five actually no I don't see number five so we have four different speeds and um, what I'm gonna do, uh, I discovered that only number three is a good one for my purposes, especially when it comes to bullet, but I decided that I want to try to to see how it's like to play with the with the first setting and see if it will actually work. So let me demonstrate on the screen how it will look. So uh, this is how I'm moving the mouse regularly. Let's say like this. This is the first one with the same way of movement. It's a little bit crazy. This is the little bit slower one. And the first one, which is the slowest, is this one. You see? It's very hard. If I move the mouse from one side of the pad to another, it will achieve... It will not barely go to the end of the screen. So, my suggestion... <coughs> Thank you. So... My suggestion is that I'll try to play some bullet with the number one setting and see how it will turn out. I'm a little bit allergic to <laughs> to stupidity, so let's see how it will go. Okay, good luck. Bullet. I have to be wise by preparing the moves in advance. Make short moves. Don't have time to make regular looking moves. Come on! Ah. Almost got it. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. It's very hard to rush with such a mouse. Ah! <laughs> it's so weird. This is actually going to become a, no a regular challenge when I feel like having fun without being successful at anything. Part without being particularly successful, let's say. Okay. Come on. We can do it. I don't know what to do next. I got no plan. Found a plan. Ah. No, but no time. Uh, 19 seconds. Come on. Wanna take on h4? Oh, the queen got lost. Snatched. Didn't notice. Can I blame the time instead of myself? So difficult to play. Ah! Ah, okay. This was fun. Let me celebrate by blowing my nose. 
to show how fun I had. <laughs> I never felt so amused about losing. Okay, so this challenge was weird, but uh, I tried it yesterday without recording and it was really, really nice. It's actually even better in company. So next time I meet some victims, I will challenge them to play with this method on the channel. And before I finish the video, I'll show you what it's like to do the other thing and play with the other setting, the super speed. Okay. <laughs> Number four on the settings. Wow, this is even better. I thought it would be better, but I'm not sure if no control or total control are preferable. It's getting too philosophical here, but then again, in chess it always does. Isn't it hanging? Let's try. Don't have time to calculate. Let's just take. Mm, oh, I'm winning something. <laughs> wow, Queen G5 even. Starts to look nice. Check. Don't want to take with that rook. With the rook pawn. <laughs> okay. Nicely done so far. Why didn't I take f3 immediately? I don't know. Let's do it this way. Okay. But it is much better, obviously, because I can play relatively quickly. <laughs> But this is still amusing. Because everything, all the pieces are running away. Okay. Mr. Kotiko 300, if you only knew what a clown you're facing. Alright, let's get it started. So this was the put a title here challenge. Let me know what you think about it. And if you want some more nonsense like this, or should I focus on the more funny or less funny stuff? But uh, for me, okay, it's not necessarily contributing to my improvement, <laughs> at least not in chess, but... <laughs> Uh, maybe my patience, but it's definitely an interesting way to exploit my uh, recent purchase. So, yeah, let me know in the comments down below. See you soon.